So there's been another one of these quiz things going around on the Facebook lately. And this one gives a bunch of stuff that you're supposed to name, but the answers you give all have to start with the first letter of your middle name. It'll make sense as we go. All right, so my middle name starts with a V. My middle name is Vern. And on that note, my first name isn't even Steve. My first name is Stee. So it's Stevern. Okay, none of that is true. It's all an inside joke. <laughs> to the two people out there who get it, never mind because they don't watch these videos anyway. Okay, so what could I wear that starts with the letter V? A vest. What could I drink that begins with the letter V? Uh, vegetable juice. Ah, there we go. I was going to go for the more obvious Russian answer, but I don't know if YouTube would like that. Place. Where's a place you could go that starts with a V? Uh, Venezuela, I guess. Where's a restaurant you could go to that starts with the letter V? Um, I'm going to cop out and say a vegan restaurant, because I don't know of any restaurants that begin with the letter V. An animal. Well, a vulture. Okay, that's more like a raven or crow sound. I don't know. What sound does a vulture make? A girl's name. How about Vanessa? A boy's name. Vincent. A profession that starts with the letter V. Well, veterinarian is super obvious. So I'm going to go with v plumber. Let's go. A word to describe someone. Very stupid. Something in your home that begins with V. Oh, <laughs> a vent. <laughs> you know, like a furnace vent. Do it. Body parts that begin with V. Well, that's not only obvious, but it's also really awkward. Vertebrae. What did you think I was going to say? And then it says middle name. Um, I I'm assuming it wants my middle name. Or does it just want anybody's middle name? Because there are, there are literally like at least 10 names that begin with V that could be used as middle names. Like... Uh... Um... Uh, well, there are lots of them, probably. <laughs> uh, Valentino. Let's go with Valentino. Or Valentina. Whatever you want. Good fun. Okay, well, that went really quick. So... I'm going to share something else with you here. Something that was too short to make a video on all its own. So we'll put it here. Early in November, I went on a men's retreat out to the Chateau Lake Louise. Beautiful place. It's like the most picturesque mountain escape you could, you could possibly think of. While I was there, I stayed in room number 3938. And I left a note underneath the lamp for someone else to find. It's just a short little note that says, hey, if you find this, Send me a message. So I guess now we sit and wait and wait and wait forever. Although, of course, what probably actually happened is the cleaning staff probably came in and was like, oh, look, someone left another one of these notes saying to send them a message. And then they probably burned it. But either way, if you go to Chateau Lake Louise and you happen to stay in room number 3938, look under the lamp because then you can send me a message. I mean, I guess you already could, but hey, that is provided whoever gets the message can actually read my writing. I have horrible writing. All right, well, that's going to do it for today. Thank you for asking. Thank you for watching, and we'll catch you later. Bye.